Hey friends, Jackie here from Interact, and today I'm going to show you how to send your quiz takers their quiz results via email using ConvertKit. Before we get started, you are going to need a quiz, so if you don't have one already, head over to ai.tryinteract.com and we will build a quiz for you. Got your quiz? Perfect! So head over to your ConvertKit account and we're going to create the emails that people will get that will contain their quiz results. So to do this, I'm going to click on send and go to sequences and you're going to want to, you're going to want to set up one sequence per quiz result that you have. So in my case, I have three quiz results. I have the low photo IQ score, the average photo IQ score. Let's go ahead and make one for the third result, the high photo IQ score. And I'll click on new sequence, name the sequence hit create. And then this is where you can start uh, typing out the email that you want to send someone that will contain their quiz results or what you want to tell someone that got this specific quiz result. Uh, you can set up the delay. I would recommend setting this immediately. So as soon as someone subscribes to the quiz, they will get this email sent to them right away. Uh, change up the body, whatever you want the email to say. And when you're ready, click publish. So now you can see I have all three email sequences set up and ready to go. You can, of course, add more emails to your sequence for the purposes of this demo. I'm just sending one email to my quiz takers after they finish their quiz. That's all the work that you need to do in ConvertKit right now. Let's head over to your Interact account to complete the integration. So from your Interact account, go to the quiz that you are setting up and click on Edit. Once the quiz opens, over on the left, turn on lead generation, and then you're able to set up your quiz opt-in form. So I want to collect email and first name here. You can customize the text on your form. Once it's to your liking, click on save and continue. Now from this list, you're going to want to choose the integration, which is ConvertKit. So click on that. You can grab the API and API secret in your ConvertKit account by clicking on your profile settings, heading down here to advanced, and then grabbing the API key and API secret. Once you have this, click connect. And this is going to connect your ConvertKit account with your Interact account. Once the account is connected, we're going to now tell Interact where to send these leads when they show up in ConvertKit. So on the first result here, the low IQ score, I'm going to click on add action. And if somebody gets this quiz result, I simply want to add them to a sequence for the low photo IQ email sequence that we already created in ConvertKit. I'll hit save and I'll do the same thing for the next result, adding the average IQ score to the sequence average photo IQ email sequence and same thing for the high IQ result add them to the high IQ email sequence and you'll know this is set up when you see these three pink lightning bolts confirming the trigger I'll hit save and continue hit save and continue again and then here you just want to make sure the opt-in form fields are mapped in ConvertKit meaning when someone subscribes with their email address it's going to the email address section in ConvertKit and same thing their first name is going into the first name field or section in ConvertKit you can because I have a scored quiz, uh, it's passed through the actual score value someone is getting from your quiz. In this case, I only need to know what result they got, that low average or high IQ score. I don't need to know the certain specific number of points that led them to that result. So I'll leave none selected right here, click save and continue. And now you're able to either test the integration or publish the quiz and test it out live. And that is how you can send personal quiz results to your Interact quiz takers using ConvertKit.